overall world record breaking, we are proud to say Malaysia is one of them. And contributing to that is Institute Jantung Negara with its many milestones which has placed Malaysia's name on the world map. And once again, IGN has made its name in the global healthcare industry for being the first hospital in Asia Pacific to implant Micra AV pacemaker. Micra AV is the world's smallest pacemaker with atrioventricular synchrony or AV. This new device is specially developed for treating patients with an atrioventricular block in their heart. The first successful Micra AV implantation was performed outside of United States, done with a couple of months of receiving the post market approval in January 2020 by the FDA. Micra AV can detect the mechanical activity of a bead in one chamber of the heart, the atrium, and then pace another chamber where Micra is implanted, the ventricle, helping the two chambers beat in rhythm. The procedure in IGN was performed by IGN's cardiac electrophysiology team led by senior consultant cardiologist and electrophysiologist Dr. Aslan Hussein in March 2020. Subsequently, two more patients were implanted with this device in the following months. First generation of uh, pacemakers those days. It has now gone down to a battery with a wire, and from that, it has progressed to a pill. Micro came into the picture as a result of research in trying to improve the uh, efficiency and safety of the old way. So the old way when we do pacemakers is that have to be wires to conduct electrical activities from the battery, batteries or the generators into the heart. So with additional wires come additional complications such as infection or wire related uh, issues. Patients who have predisposition towards infection, for example patients with renal failure, they are better off with Micra than with uh, standard conventional uh, pacemakers. Uh, Malaysia contributed uh, a lot of uh, clinical background and uh, clinical knowledge to help develop this uh, from Micra, the first generation Micra to the uh, second generation uh, Micra. The IGN Cardiac Electrophysiology team was deeply involved in the device development as well as the preclinical studies since 2018. The Micra AV was developed by Medtronic is a new technology unlike traditional pacemakers because the device does not require cardiac wires under the skin to deliver a pacing therapy. So the challenges in the study was to get the right patients, all right? Uh, and of course, all these patients are a bit more elderly and they come from out of Kuala Lumpur. So when it became commercial, of course, the next step was the COVID-19 came in. So we had a lot of restriction getting in this device to be the, ne that would be the center to implant it. Right, so uh, Micro AV is the leadless pacemaker. So it's the second generation leadless pacemaker compared to the previous one, uh, Micro VR. Less than one tenth of the si size of the conventional pacemaker. And also it's just uh, about the size of a vitamin pill. We have been collaborating with IGN for many, many years. I think more than 10 years in terms of the clinical studies and also for a lot of education workshops. So IGN has a very experienced electrophysiology team and I think uh, has a, having an excellent uh, facilities here in IGN. So we foresee that uh, there will be a lot more clinical research which Medtronic is going to partner IGN. Well, this did a very proud day for IGN and we are immensely uh, happy and immensely proud that you know, we've been able to bring the latest technology uh, to this country. And I think that this technology will be able to help a lot of nations who have certain types of heart disease which requires a pacemaker. Technology always advances, so what our goal in IGN is to ensure that we are not left behind. Okay? Whatever is available in the world, we want to be able to embrace and adopt technologies that are going to impact our patients in Malaysia. This technological breakthrough provides a lot of potential benefits and a shorter procedure time, giving more way for qualitable healthcare. I'm Mariam Azmi, thanks for watching Heart News, reminding everyone to stay safe and don't forget to subscribe.